What is I am is the jiva. His sarup is there, and that is always the nature to serve. Are you work in company? You work in yoga. You work any place. Is service or not? Your nature, jiva nature, to serve. You cannot serve, you cannot be. Service is the way in, in bodily consciousness to come out from that. And in divine consciousness, in spiritual consciousness, and in prema rasa, if you have a love also, this seva is on the working. And which consciousness of your stage is there? If you block in your body and you are talking from that, then you are talking from mind, not from heart. So when you say, don't use the mind word, mind is the ego word. This also understand, means you are talking, okay, but in through the mind, through, through the ego. Through the heart you talk, through the feeling. He says, Manobhritti is a mind of talking and Chintavritti is heart talking. Understand? So, why this Raga Bhakti is there to understand? Because this Raga Bhakti is preparing me where to go. Loving way. When I will go back, when I will leave this body, I, I, where I go? Why I need this? Are when you go to take bath, you decide the clothes of what I will wear or not. You bring with him in bathroom to wear that. So you prepare before taking bath that where you will go. You will dress like this. So you ne never want to dress, you want to know what you have, want to dress. Dressing of your clothes is changing your body. <laughs> Understand? Clear? So every day you dress your clothes when you take bath. <coughs> you prepare, you are conscious, but you are not ready to understand the how to dress after leaving this body. <laughs> This is ignorance or not. So what is Raga Bhakti? To love myself, that I am a soul, I am a jiva. This is the basic of Raga Bhakti. If I don't love myself, I will not care for that. Understand? Only I will work and I will die also one day, leave this body, for what nothing, nobody will remember me with. But when I will realize myself, I know where to go. 
I'm not think right, right or wrong. And that is Raghavakti. It cannot possible to do without love. If you have no, no love for yourself, how if you are not honest, I am not honest with myself, what I am honest with others? And this consciousness open with your loving nature. Loving nature, to first you love yourself. Name ruchi jive daya. I explain you jive daya. What is meaning of jive daya? Say it. Compassion towards myself. What is your opinion? I must understand my position. That is the point. If I don't understand position, how I will love myself? That position has to understand. Mahaprabhu said, Name Ruchi. Why not test in coming in name? Because I don't know myself. Why not test full? Why not I like to chant? I am twenty years old devotee, thirty years old, and still I have no test in name. Why? Because I don't understand myself. How foolish I am. I am a jiva, I know accept it. I am so much in false identification. What is I am not, I had identified that. And when you will check, that where I think is love, honestly, that is not love. If you have a love once in life, you never leave it. You die for love. You die. Love is ready to die, my dear. Love not that you can change it. Today this, tomorrow that. And if the tendency of changing is there, it's no love. <laughs> die? How die? If I love myself, I will never die if I know myself. That is Agvad Gita When I love myself, then I can say, I know Jiva there. Because I know my Jiva and I can see inside all of you Jiva. So, this is vision, but it is a divine vision. When you will practice, you will see. And who has the divine wizard, he will have, he will get the test or name or not. <coughs> because I am in love. He opened me this wizard and my Gurudev give only name, why not I will do this? I will forget all nonsense. There is no meaning for other things. At the time of giving mantra, he not say any other thing. He said, do it. I do it. When you will do with this sincerity, the result will come. You will realize the meaning of the name. Name Ruchi. The test will come. Test will come. Ruchi. You don't want to leave even the sleeping time also. It's going on. You can watch it. Toilet time, every time is going on. It's never non-stop is happening. Name Ruchi, that is Ruchi. 
and what is the service? Vaishnav Seva. <coughs> like everyone is senior than me. Everyone, no junior. Then again ego is coming. Huh? You see? If ego will come, Kapoor, again he will come in body counsel. The moment ego comes, that I am so educated, I am so old, I am a guru, I am this, I am that, is ego. False ego. To bring you out from the reality. Simple. Now you decide what to do. You have to live in false or you want to be in reality. If you are in reality, you can see the reality. If you are living and identifying your false, you will see. Only interested in looking false. <coughs> if you do not use your body in service, lust, you cannot come out from the lusty desire of service. Because false ego will use you as in lust. He will say, do it, then your identification will be there. If you not, lust will not grow for all the senses, then your identification of material identification will finish. Then jiva will come, and he don't want jiva should come. It's a false ego job. You don't know about jiva, this is false ego job. So where to to check myself to, to the false ego that I want to know that my jiva, myself? This is the conflict. This is the scripture, all the scripture is written for this. And if you not understand, you have to know to understand this, where you want to live in this deha. While Raghunath Das Goswami, I say to repeat this, no, he don't want to live in his material identification. He's not interested because he started to stop doing everything outside. He started doing everything inside and he's fixed in that. <coughs> if this position come, then you don't need to do that. But if it's not coming, then you have to do it sadhakta. Right? Here, yeah? And when you are in Siddhadeha, in your spiritual identification, in Jiva consciousness, everything you relate like your subject. You are subject. This is the reality. Their joking is the reality. Their sharing is the reality. Their exchange is the reality. What is I am searching for love? That is not reality. Why I lose this to identify unreality and I forget this to come in? <coughs> it's coming in, not going out and it's a place. <coughs> So, Gurudev, this is this Lila, what's happening, Acharya sir explaining, they are real realities. This is the reality. When you will see with your divine vision, then you will understand how this wealth is, how this wealth is, how they are joking, easy way. They are so, so, so deep to understand their feelings. 
only Radhika embraces Krishna and without knowing he says, you are Krishna. By wife he understands. He is a Krishna. He is Navina Sakti is not there. He is not a girl. He is a boy. He becomes with the breast and everything like a female. But his wife was for Radhika is very clear to understand. Is a feeling, pure feeling was there. Is not material. Radha is not a material body like us. Radhika is the condensed feeling, Mahabhava Sarupa. Radha is not a female. Radha is a condensed form of the feeling. Is Radha. Krishna is is a condensed form of feeling. We think that like a male and female Leela is happening. It's not. Is a condensed form of feeling. And condensed is a rasa. Raso Vaisa is Krishna. Without condensed form of feeling, there is no rasa. You cannot see rasa. Fifty-nine, see that one. Then you will understand. Ah. Condensed form of feeling is Radha. And I have no feeling. So I am not female nature. I have a still nature of enjoyment. I have no feelings. To developing the feelings is the beauty of the... And we are living in material world to come out from the feelings. To stop the feelings. And Mahaprabhu is in the living in the highest feeling. I was in South America beginning. Seven days I am listening to the class of other sannyasis. He said, no become sentimental. No become sentimental. No become sentimental. One day I said, new person, I was in Girasthasram, they are sannyasis, they are talking right. Two days, three days. After seven days, I cannot digest it. <laughs> I bring all the sannyasi who is talking about sentimental, sentimental. I sit all I say, I want to discuss you, I want to learn you. What is the meaning of the word sentimental? When I, then they say, that what is sentimental. I said, what about Chaitanya Mahaprabhu? He was not sentimental or what? <laughs> See, yes, it's sentimental. So what you are telling about? To not become sentimental? And Mahaprabhu is teaching that you become sentimental. What is right? I mean, I have no idea, I don't understand this. You say no sentimental, and he say only to become sentimental. <laughs> it's I say sentimental, not to become in the bodily sentimental. I say, why talk about that? Why not you talk higher than this? What I am practicing in day-to-day -day life, what to practice talking on that subject? Are, what I am not doing, that has to be Jaiva Dharma, right or not? What is I am doing in Namastik Anitya Dharma, what to talk on that? Huh? I see the Jaiva Dharma book, I like that book, but when I see too much pages is written of Navratik Dharma, Nitya Dharma, I stop. I say, what is the use to read this? <laughs> to, to increase my Navratik and Nitya Dharma. It is I am doing. What to come out from that? Java Dharma book is should be right. 
And the sannyasis of the book leader, they talk only in na- na- namatic and anitta dharma, not jab dharma. Because that jab dharma you have to got the realization to talk, right? <laughs> Experience is not there. Radhe, kya desa sir? Camera wala usko chao sa ka din. But? हम तो सेवा के लिए तैयार रहते हैं भैया वही नहीं आते आ गया सब कुछ तो मेरा उन कैमरे का पैसा तो लौटा दिया हो गया ठीक है तो दिस इज द पॉइंट Talk the subject, what I am not doing. What is normally doing, I identify my senses, body and enjoying senses. What is details to know? Who knows more than me? Seventy <laughs> years practice, sixty, fifty years practice, and again to know that. I know something. But I not do right or not. That is to know with the Ramya Bhakti. It is not a foreign thing. It is a thing to prepare myself what to do after leaving this body. And that is the most, most, most important thing. To practice from now, then is possible to do it. Understand? That was the subject. To feel it, develop your feeling. That Radhika's feel it, not touching. Without touching, but he want to know that he want to hug her. To say to after that, this is the first time. <laughs> By touching the vibration, see, feel that he is not Navina Sakhi. He is not a female. He is a guy, and he is not other guy. He is my Krishna. That is the first time, right? Feeling. This is a feeling, right? Mm-hmm. It, it said, but while she embraces Navina, she feels a familiar shivering over her own body, <coughs> and that makes her doubt. Yeah. <laughs> Who is this? <laughs> you see. <laughs> Severe, severe, means see all the four of the hair is standing because she was angry with Krishna and she also want to meet Krishna and Krishna is not ready. Krishna want also to meet, but he is very fearful that how much Lalita and other will. Just eyes, so he make this way to me. You see how loving they are. Love makes this way to me. <coughs> to feel it, to develop your feeling, yeah. that is the beauty of divine love. If you not had a feeling, and you want that, oh, I'm happy with no feeling. <laughs> that bad he was is good. When ragvakti means to know yourself, love yourself, and feel yourself, it's a ragu. And live in the feeling is a ragu. Love. Rag is not only final thing. Rag is the way. 
Lang means one-sided love. I love her. I love you. Is a rag. But anurag is this. I love Ma Bhakti Hima Giri. And she also loved me. That is anurag. This is both sides love. One side love is good or both sides love is good. Same. Yes, that is anurag. But you have to start one side love. If you not show your love that you are in love, you, why you go to the temple in Arati even? I show my love to you that I love you. When you go this way with this feeling, He will show you His love to you. All right? That is a change of love. If you not make the exchange of love after coming in Vrindavan, very difficult to do outside of Vrindavan. This is the highest vibration that you can connect easily to. You imagine what is happening is not Gopinath is doing, not Sadhu Maharaj is doing. It's happening. And why is happening? Because his desire is this. Their love is to, for you. You want to give everything, but I have to ready to receive it. I have to go open heart to receive it. If I am not ready to receive, how somebody can give it? He is not. He will wait for that moment. And if you want, then he will give it. Right? Wanting is important. You love also when you feel you want that, and you receive also when you want it. Wanting is very important in love. Your desire is important, wanting. You don't want one lover, how a lover will come to you? If you want one lover, it will come. Right or not? You are happy with uh, in the material, okay, happy. <laughs> if you're not, you have some other want than Radhe Radhe. There is no explanation of past time. You cannot explain the past time. You have to feel it with your heart, this is the past. In between, before and after, it comes. How to listen it? Like here, this line was there, Raghunath Das Goswami has no material identification of body. Why? Because he is in the love and separation. This life, pray again. Sri Raghunath Das, <coughs> Sri Raghunath Das is the embodiment of love, peace and separation. Embodiment? Yes. His body was love and suffering. I can't lie. He has no body. No body. No body means this body. No body. <laughs> Where? He has no body in this world. You see? And I, my body is in this world. <laughs> My senses is working in this world. My body is there. 
my false ego is coming to me, how I will know my jiva? Thousands of books you read, thousands of class you listen, it's not possible to change you. Hundred percent, I say you. Without your greed, desire, if you have no desire, it will nothing change. Only your greed, your desire will change all in one minute. If you have a greed, it will change you. How to develop this greed? Greed, association. The greedy person to associate, <laughs> he will make you greedy. <laughs> that is the only way to become greedy. He has no other job. He cannot live in other business. He is a greedy. He is a greedy, so is he is not old. Old is the when I have no greed. If I am a great, I am a girl, a little baby. I am searching. Babies are searching, child is just. But I am, I am young, but I will become old because I have no great. <coughs> we make you mad, yeah? <laughs> mad. Agla. Hmm. And madness to know myself is a reality, not Pagarpa. No, living in false ego is Pagarpa. <coughs> reality is this. But false ego say, this is your Pagarpa that you want to not know the thing what I show you, you want to know what is not, never see you. You never see his soul is there, and you are running for that. It's a crazy idea. Who fool tell you to go, go for that when you never see it? Never do this. I'm with you, and lust is with you. Why you know my body is with you? Survive with this consciousness. Enjoy and live in that. You see. This is false ego. Are you crazy? One person say your soul is there. I mean, where is the soul? You see? Why are you running for that? This type of thing, teaching false ego. And the association of the false ego is <coughs> good. I mean, what is in reality, I show you a cup and you don't believe it. <laughs> and somebody say, in outside the one room has it, the one box, there is all the ornaments, you are bothering that. No! Here you believe that is a cup. And enjoy this cup. All nine cups I give you, or you enjoy and die with this. One time you come to live, you never come again to enjoy this. Then live and die with this enjoyment. And last say, I am ready to serve you, my dear. <laughs> Where to work? <laughs> I am living in Muladhara. You start with that. <laughs> That is also, not only Muladhara, I am Brahmin also. My lips are Brahmin, it is place of Brahmin, eyes is Brahmin, nose is nose, ear, these are all Brahmin. Maximum is in Brahmin condition. You try to teach to the Brahmins? <laughs> They will never listen here. This is Brahman. They will never listen. You will give to Sudra one slab, he will listen to you. Muladhara can listen, he one, two slab. You say there is a toilet, go there, he will go that way. 
may be, but Brahman is not ready to listen. He will fight, he will argue with you, but not agree with you. This is the Brahman. So he will become teacher and guru, very difficult to teach you. And if you are born in Brahmin body, it's very difficult to teach you because you are already gifted with this mula, mula dhara no. Gyan indriyas. This is the problem. Too much knowledge is also is happening like this. Gyan indriya is so many activities. Not ready to live. Not ready to accept. Very difficult. <laughs> you see, my one of Brahmin is coming, Ram Saruti, he will be there. used to try to follow him. He is living in 20, 30 years, 40 years. He say something, he understands. He will start talking and explaining you something else. Brahmins. <coughs> Many Brahmins are like this. Understand? Careful with Brahmins. <laughs> Muladhara, you can do slap and you can balance it because one, two senses are there. But this, what is the Gyan Indriya? Very different. Oh, you. Yeah. 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 This is the reason. Why in the past time? Why is this? Is there body? Is a feeling body? Not my lusty body. And raso vaisaha is a full of rasa and full of feeling. If one drop feeling will not come, I will never understand Rasa. I will never understand Krishna. Only I will see like a God. Very nice, fifty-nine degrees. <laughs> yeah, very good. Read and, and feel it. Not 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 sit down. Morning sit and read. I'm always ready to listen. I'm a DD. I'm sitting up to eleven for the kids. You're not the brother. You're not the brother. Trying to improve my prema, I am missing. Rati, Rati, go.